Here we are with Call of the Night episode 4, and yeah, last episode we met Ko's childhood friend Akira, and I feel like uh, Nazuna was maybe a bit jealous, because Akira, Akira asked him to come back to school, and he didn't answer right away, and then Nazuna stormed off basically, because she was ticked off, because I think she maybe was afraid that Ko would really consider to go back to school, and then he couldn't hang out at night with her anymore, um, but yeah, the end was basically that they kissed <laughs> at the end of the episode, which was really surprising for me that we get a kiss in the fourth episode already. Um, but yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe or comment. I would really appreciate it and it would really help me. But yeah, let's get to the episode. Flashback? <laughs> because of video games? <laughs> oh yeah, I know that too well. Nah. Hell nah. <laughs> That's something I don't know. God damn, dude! What's with today's episodes? Like, like yesterday, Oji san and uh, harem in the labyrinth with like naked girls <laughs> and showers, and now this here <laughs> with these. These episodes this season go all hand in hand. Also with OG Sun having like an end like Call of the Night with flying around through the night sky and all this stuff. And sneaking out again. Here we go. <laughs> again. <laughs> oh, he remembers. Of course he does. Oh, she's waiting. Oh, really? Aww. Okay, so he has to think about it. What happened with the kiss? The act. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Blood. Tasty. Yum, yum. It's those guys. Hey, and they're not drunk. I mean, not as drunk as normally. Must be early in the night. <laughs> really? Yes, somewhat in most cases, I guess. No. Not necessarily. Maybe. I mean, try it out and let her suck your blood, and if you become a vampire, then you know, right? <laughs> Let's go! Oh, she found him. Fight me. <laughs> I've fallen in love with you. Fight me and I'll become a vampire. <laughs> oh, here we go. But I mean, we know that he won't turn into a vampire. <laughs> and nothing changes. <clears throat> <laughs> At least it tastes good for her. And it's even not the pr it's not even the prime time for her to suck the blood. He just thinks it. Exactly. <laughs> she knows. <laughs> yes. Exactly. <laughs> he got flustered because of it. Because it was so surprising. I think not. Oh, yes, dude. <laughs> His face. I, I guess he doesn't care. I mean, yes, depends on your kind of friendship and stuff, right? This is interesting, these two different viewpoints again. 
Ko is like, hey, that's what lovers do and people that you love. And she's like, that's what, that, that's what friends do. So it's like, again, like Mother difference. Yusha. Completely opposite. Psyching. And she's the same as Ko, that she is not enjoying school anymore and can't sleep well. It's morning. At midnight, she takes a long walk. Oh, so it's the next day already. <clears throat> nah, that's what daytime is for. <laughs> Why? As, dude, if Ko wouldn't sleep, you would be dead already. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> they are playing games. Oh, dude, they play Street Fighter. Good dang. And a PlayStation 1. <laughs> ah, so she wants to play games at least. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, shocker. She's like, what? I want to be supportive, but... She's not a monster, come on, be nice. She's not a monster indeed. <laughs> what did she say? Wait. Oh. Ah, I mean, he wants to, right? Oh, now they play a visual novel. Doki Doki suing club. <laughs> no. Yeah, no school for me. <laughs> I can't be bothered. Yeah. It can be annoying. こんな真剣にギャラゲーってできるんだ。Just <laughs> 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 run. Another girl, right? What I thought. <laughs> right? <laughs> of course. Of all the space she runs into her. Uh, yeah. Him. Oh. Goddamn. <laughs> <laughs> She's normally talking. <laughs> right, I mean, he wants to like Nazuna, and she doesn't have big boobs, right? Wholesome, indeed it is! I love me some wholesomeness. Yeah, she needs she wants her blood. <laughs> Akira just doesn't know how it works with those two. <laughs> Guy, girl, girl, you know. <laughs> All three together, Jesus. <laughs> Oh, it's raining outside. And she sucks him again. <laughs> Sucking blood? I mean, I guess she needs to, right? It's food. Supply and demand. <laughs> Exactly. Because he wants to become a vampire. <laughs> oh, it's so good. I love it. You just come out with it. Like, the reason why. Come on. Do it. Tell us the truth. You want to become a vampire. Yes! And now tell her how it works because otherwise she's confused. 
You can become a vampire. No. Exactly, no. Tell her how it works. Yes. <laughs> I'm sleepy. Then go to sleep, we talk. There we go. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Again, she's embarrassed by it. I love their relationship. It works so well together. Exactly, yes. I love that. <laughs> if it lets up. <laughs> what I'm doing at night, getting my blood sucked by a vampire. In hopes that I become a vampire. Uh oh. Are they grabbing hands, holding hands together? Connect. Maybe not. Exactly. Nothing much changes, I guess. Exactly. My thoughts. Man, I like this wholesomeness. <laughs> she can't try. I guess Nazuna is awake and eavesdrops and listens and hears everything. Then guess she falls asleep right now and sleeps for the first time in like a long time. A good sleep, a good night. <coughs> yep. <laughs> Where's Nazuna? Maybe somewhere, somewhere where the sun isn't shining. Because I'm wondering if sun is bad for her. <laughs> Oh, she's right there. I guess so. Not answering. Man, awesome episode, bro. Okay, this was episode 4 and a great episode again. Um, we have the beginning where we get reconfirmed again that Naz uh, that Akira is basically in the same situation as Ko, um, where she has like trouble falling asleep, she's not enjoying her daily life, and um, when she l came home, she's like, yeah, here, yeah, I'm back, but it seems like no one is there or no one is answering. Kind of like when Ko left to because he wanted to go to school at the beginning in like one flashback, and no one was answering him, or it seemed like there was there wasn't. Uh, there wasn't anyone um, when he said, like, yeah, I'm off to school. Um, so it's it feels similar, right? And then we get to the situation with Nazana and Ko, where he thinks that he's in love, because if you kiss someone, then you are clearly in love with someone. And then uh, Nazana sucks his blood, and he is not turning into a vampire, because obviously he's not really in love with her yet. Um, but in Nazana's mind, it's like you kiss friends. So it's like, again, these like differences, right? In Ko's mind, it's like you are in love when you kiss someone. In Nazuna's mind, it's like if you are friends. Um, it's, again, two opposites, which is like their whole chemistry, right? That they are like basically opposites. And then later when we meet Akira again with Ko and he invites her to Nazuna and Nazuna's and they play games and everything and, they exp and he explains to Akira basically what he wants, why he is out at night, um, what his goal is basically, that he wants to fall in love with Nazuna to become a vampire and everything, and tells her how it works exactly, because she thought, hey, if you get bitten, that's enough, right? And he's like, no, that's not the point. Uh, it's work it works differently. And so everything gets explained. And um, But yeah, even while Akira is not completely fond of Nazuna, she's still somewhat supportive Oko, right? And still had a great time hanging out with them both. So much so that she could fall asleep at night or in the morning and have a good night of sleep again. Probably in a quite some time. So yeah, great episode. I really like it. 
And again, I can't wait to see where this is going because I really like the chemistry between Nazana and Ko, and I just want to see more. Uh, and definitely, I, I mean, we're still missing many characters we saw in the intro, so I can't wait to see when we get introduced to the next characters. But yeah, if you like what you saw, or, or if you want to support me, leave a like, subscribe, or comment. I would really appreciate it. And yeah, thanks for watching. And until next time, bye-bye.